What's good, YouTube? This your boy, What's Good, Elias, and I'm back with another video for you guys today. And um, I'm just going to make a video for you guys about what is going on on Madden Mobile. Okay, I know I told you guys in a previous video how to, you know, um, make coins. When I was telling you that, that was going to be my last video. But this right here, this is my last video, I promise you guys. I'm sorry that y'all thought that was my last video. But um, this is my last video because I said I probably, that would be my last video that probably be my last video but today this video right here is my last video okay today i'm just gonna tell you what does the season score mean because you probably like why is there a season score in the corner of my madden mobile game the season score tells you that whenever you complete an objective whenever you complete um whenever you complete any, any of these things these help you to get packs for the next Madden Mobile game. Now, you see when you click rewards, it says earning progress in each season score category will increase the number of reward packs that you can redeem at the start of next season. And you can also choose to trade in the packs you earn toward bigger prizes. So basically, season score is getting you ready for the next Madden Mobile. So anytime you complete an objective, it completes the percentage and it keeps going until you get to 100. When you get to 100, it increases the packs you will get. So it says, again, earning progress in each season score category will increase the number of award packs that you can redeem at the start of the next season. Now, what that's trying to tell you is that each time you're earning progress, you're doing objectives, you're completing achievements, you're, you know, doing your job on this game, you... The, the categories will increase the number of reward packs that you can redeem at the start of the next season. So when Madden Mobile comes out and you got about 20 packs, that's how many packs you can redeem on the new Madden Mobile that they will be creating. Okay, so right now I got 11. That's how many packs I will be getting next season. That's how many packs I can open. So what I'm trying to tell you is y'all might want to get back on Madden Mobile because... If y'all keep playing, if y'all get 30 packs, I'm telling you, y'all team will probably be at 85 overall next season. I don't know. They're, they're going to be doing some more elite players. But at the beginning of the game, you will get the many packs that you get if you complete the progress in each season score. Now, look what it says you can do with these um season score uh, once you redeem the coins. It says you can also choose to trade in the packs. You earn toward bigger prizes. So, if you got these packs and you see bigger prizes, you can trade in the packs for bigger prizes. So, I think there's something new coming on Madden Mobile where if you get packs, you can trade it in for bigger prizes. I don't know. But they just told us that you can trade in these packs, you earn toward bigger prizes. So, all 11 of those packs that you probably will get, or I'm going to get, or if you get 20, if you get 30, you can trade in the packs you earn to earn bigger prizes, bro. So what I'm trying to say is if there's bigger things coming on Madden Mobile, you still have those packs, you probably can change or trade in for something bigger. I'm not saying like in the future when it's like August and then November, you still got those packs and you're trying to get something bigger. No, like that month only probably, or like in September, Till the week is over, whatever week they say, you can trade in for those packs. But you can use those packs to trade in for bigger prizes. I'm so excited for this next Madden Mobile game. Okay, now you're asking, how can I get my packs up? Okay, you go, you can click on any of these, but let's start over here. Okay, they got objectives. They got two objectives every day. This will always change, like at least a, um every day. But today, this had changed because before it said you needed 1760 in yards and uh, rushing in on season. So you go to season and you do what you got to do. And you got to do these objectives. So right here it says score 175 points. It says 8 points. I don't know if that's on. on um, I don't know if that's on a lot of events on season, but I think it's on season. So you have to score 175 points to get 1500 coins. And that will boost your um, season pack percentage to another set, probably. Like 20%, 30%, depends. Okay. 
if you do these, if you get your special teams to a 92, if you get your defense and your offense to a 99, it will increase as well. Now, I'm not going to view my lineup because I don't really need two. It's a 94 and a 93. Okay. They will also increase this if your level is up. If you pass level 75, they'll help you level up as well. And your achievements. You need at least 200 achievements for them to increase your percentage. Okay, then you need to win at least um, 10 Super Bowls. You need to at least have more than um, 10 seasons completed. And then you need to, uh, I think they're saying you need to win 20, um, you need to win 20 playoffs. But I'm not going to season mode. And then do head-to-head. -head. And then also, if it says if you win league-to-league -league tournaments, you can increase your season score. So I advise you to, you know, go back to your league, do some um, games and season. I don't know if there's going to be anybody playing. And then you just complete the sets, man. So I hope you like this video, man. I'm sorry if it's too long for you guys. Um, I'm going to try to make a shorter video as possible. But please press that like, subscribe button, bro. And I'm out.